Hey, it's Joe Lyons. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate um, copying and pasting data in Excel and deciding what kind of format you want to keep. So you've probably done something in Excel before where you can come in here and let's say we, we, we highlight some and hit copy. When we go to hit paste, we can say paste options and paste special. And there's a list of a lot of different options. These are the, the pasting options. There's other things you can do, but um, what we're talking about here is the pasting options up in here. So, um, programmatically not a hotkey we can we can do those different things um of course i have a function in my function library um first we're getting a handle to excel which go check out the other videos on that um, it's one of my first videos in doing um connecting to excel with the function and then um we got to tell it a range and so in here i'm gonna tell it a1 to f9 so that's basically you know here down to here um, so we say where it's, we're copying it from and then where we want to paste it to. And if I click in here, you'll see. So that's the destination range. This is the the source, the destination. Of course, it's my pointer. And then this is the, the format you want to do. So if we just said one, right, it's going to paste it just like you normally just hit paste. So um, the other thing I have is a message box deposit. And then this next one clears out the data so I don't have to keep going back in and clearing it out. So let me, let me make sure I save it, reload it, and run it. So that would actually paste everything as you see it, right? Not a big deal. whoop de doo right? Okay, but it's still good to know. Um, you don't actually have to use paste special for that. I think just dot paste in the, the script will work. But um, let's say two would be values. So two, when I run it, now line nine through, uh, yeah, actually line nine, nine, A through F, are actually um, formulas. Right, the rest of them are actual numbers. These are formulas, but look over here, it actually pasted the values, right? So that's a really handy one when you don't want to keep the formulas. Let's say you want to give something to someone, but you don't want to let them maybe be able to tweak the spreadsheet or to see the formulas that created it, right? It's a great easy way to do this. Um, so it's two, let's say, um, let's do all except borders. So seven, seven, everything should look the same except for line two. Uh, I think shouldn't have the borders around it. So that can strip out the borders. I don't think that's overly helpful, but hey, it's part of the thing, right? Um, column width is interesting because it doesn't actually paste the data. It pastes the widths of the columns. And um, I had actually run this once before and got caught up in something, so I stopped. So let me, let me redo this. And you'll notice the columns adjust. The widths will adjust. So here, let me save it, reload it, and run it. And so notice the columns came to be what these are here but there's no data and again it's you know this if you've already pre-formatted data but you don't have the same exact data it's a great easy way to borrow from it i mean we could have we could have pasted the formatting um the formats let's do that so after we do that oh it's going to delete it but we'll just still do four so i wouldn't be clearing it out each time right but um so that um put in the border um i think if we had words here some stuff would be bold oh and the font color I'm like, that's going to be bold and that's not, right? So it's taking care of that stuff for us. So that cleared that out. Um, the formulas, numbers, and values, number so 11 and 12, they're basically the same thing. Um, an interesting point, which is what caught me up earlier, was uh, I wanted to show the function behind this. And so basically, I looked up in Excel what each of these, um, these are built-in constants in Excel, and they have these interesting, weird numbers. But then everything after the fifth one is actually the number that it is. And so then it's just like, um, I have it here a little to the right. So all except orders equals seven. So um, so that's why the seven up here sticks. But I don't have to do all this funky stuff. You just pass a seven to the, um, yeah, to this spot right here. And then it, it pastes the way you want it to. So... Anyway, it's a cool, super easy to use function that, um, man, when you're trying to, to borrow from other stuff or especially or strip out formatting for both of those things, it's, it's really helpful. The other thing is if you're, if you copy data outside of Excel, it, I don't think it pays much attention. Um, it'll probably default to more like RTF or not. Maybe you can paste as plain text. Um, I haven't tried it, but, um, it's, yeah, it doesn't, things inside Excel work great copying from outside. And even then it's a, it's a pain with the newer versions of Excel. Um, it's a lot of security stuff. So anyway, hope that helps. Cheers.